Hi, I'm Green Boy, and I have so much shit to talk about. It is borderline worthy of its own update video, so yeah. Okay, so this first bit, it's kind of a PSA, but I felt like this was a big enough issue to mention, and that is like the spam comments as well as the hacking that have been going around lately. Basically, a lot of YouTubers have gotten hacked, whether it was on YouTube or outside of YouTube, and all I'm gonna say is, be very careful. I don't want you guys to lose your channel. That's all I'm gonna say. I will mention some things though, and that is I never do giveaways and I never use WhatsApp. So if you find an impersonator of me in the comments, just assume it's a fake, report them, block them, move on, okay? <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. But if there's like an AI voice being used, just make sure you know about the subtle nuances of AI voices so that you can better protect yourself from a lot of these scams. Because Obviously, you don't want to you don't want to buy shit that Joe Rogan promoted cuz that was friggin' whacked. And also pay close attention to what you install or download onto your PC because that can also be problematic cuz they could just steal your cookies. And you know what happens once they steal your online cookies, like you're screwed, plain and simple. Okay, now that that little PSA is out of the way, which by the way, I felt was pretty important, let's talk about the final video of the year and that is the rush review for the Bayonetta trilogy. Yeah, I teased that I think last year or a couple years ago, but it's finally done. I had to work on that right after I finished the Cyberpunk revisit, so uh, yeah, I need a break after this. And yes, the Rush of You Season 2 compilation video is pretty much finished and has already been scheduled for YouTube, and that comes out on January 12th. It is three hours long, containing two years worth of videos. Good God. <laughs> but yeah, after the Season 2 compilation, I'm gonna be taking it a little easy throughout January. I'm gonna just take a break, de-stress, and relax because I desperately need it. I have been working my ass off trying to get these videos out, and uh, it worked, but uh, my god, I'm exhausted. My plans for season three onwards is like a higher quality, more story elements, more jokes, and longer videos. Yeah, that's kind of it. In fact, I'm sure you may have noticed some episodes from season two they were kind of practice for this format, and I actually am having a lot of fun with that. So, I want to keep that up. But because I want to prioritize quality over quantity, um, I can no longer upload videos once a month. Yeah, I've been uploading once a month for like a couple of years now, and at this point, it is becoming much harder to do so. Especially because life is getting in the way, and I kind of have to shift my priorities for a little bit, just to kind of, you know keep everything stable and make me sane. Oh yeah, and the rating system I had for part of season one and the entirety of season two, yeah, I'm gonna be discontinuing that because it's getting a lot harder to rate games with this rating system. And just for an example, there was a couple games throughout season two that were very hard to rate with the rating system that I had. And I'm like, okay, if I'm gonna keep doing this, I have to get rid of the rating system because it is getting far too hard for this. By the way, Rush of You First Impressions will stay the exact same, and it is just me, raw gameplay, and my thoughts. And that basically amounts to any game, or any new game, I can get a hold of day one. Hence why I have such a quick turnaround for some of these videos. And even if Rush of You's back on YouTube, by the way, I will still be uploading them to Odyssey. However, they're, they're both gonna be essentially identical. So if there's swears that I have to censor, in one version for one version, then the other one's gonna have to suffer through it as well. Because I wanna keep things as consistent as possible and lessen the workload. Because making uncensored versions of these, it's fine, but it's having to censor them that adds on top of the workload that I gotta do for these videos, so yeah. Oh, and speaking of Odyssey, the company behind the, the back end for Odyssey, Library Inc., uh, they're fucking dead. There's an Odyssey post in the pinned comment below or the description that'll explain the situation. But if you want my opinion, like, this shit sucks, man. I loved using Odyssey and the fact that I could, you know, back up my content to the platform in case YouTube ever decides to eviscerate me for whatever reason, it's a good safety net. And I know I've been uploading exclusively to Odyssey for the past couple of years because of YouTube shenanigans and stuff like that. But because the company behind the back end to Odyssey is gone now, I don't know how long Odyssey is gonna stick around for. One thing is certain though, I will keep uploading to Odyssey until Odyssey just completely disappears. 
Because of that, I have to consider another backup alternative. I am thinking about backing my stuff up to either Rumble or PeerTube, but I'm still kind of on the fence about that, and I need to, like, kind of sit on it for a little bit and see what happens. All right, so I'm sure you guys may have noticed the intro earlier, and that is the fact that I am rebranding from Green Boy to Green Boy the Vertical Jade, with the Bayonetta Trilogy video being the final video to use this Green Boy branding, and this video and the compilation is going to use the new branding, so uh, I figured I'd mention that now before you guys get confused or something. I've rebranded so many times, it's not even funny. Jesus Christ. All right, now, I do want to touch upon the Vertical Jade YouTube channel, which was formerly Green Boy Plus. I got rid of it. So if you notice the FNAF Behind the Scenes video uploaded to the main YouTube channel, yeah, that's why. I deleted it because I wasn't using it as much, and I honestly was stretching myself a little too thin. And I needed to just focus my energy on this main channel, Odyssey, and my Twitter. And with that Green Boy Plus channel in the mix, I couldn't spread my attention equally to everything. There's a community post that explains the situation, but um, I already updated all the links. So if I missed one, then, uh, whoops. I did plan on also leaving Twitter slash X. I'm calling it Twitter, I don't give a damn. But because everybody uses it, I kinda have no choice but to come back. For those of you who don't know, I do have a Mastodon page, and I've been advertising my videos there for the past few months, but because of how small Mastodon is compared to Twitter, uh, it's a lot harder to promote my stuff there. So I got no other choice but to start promoting my stuff on Twitter again. This also means I'm going to have to stop promoting my stuff on Mastodon, and I'm going to have to rework how that kind of works. But aside from that, it'll be same as it was before I even stopped promoting my stuff on Twitter. Hope that makes sense. Oh, by the way, uh, I forgot to mention this in the initial recording, but uh, I plan on returning to streaming one day. Still kind of wondering which platforms to stream to, although Twitch seems like the most attractive option. YouTube might be fine, but it might be a little screwy with algorithms and stuff. Odyssey's an absolute pain in the dick to stream on. Facebook gaming, don't make me laugh. And kick? We don't talk about kick. All right, so to finally end this off, I want to talk about upcoming Rush reviews that are in the works. I do have four other videos that have been circling around in my head. Two of them have been based off of YouTube's research tool, you know? So I'm going to see if that's going to work. If it does work, then you know I'm going to be taking advantage of that more often. The other two, by the way, have been circling in my head for quite a long time, and it was stuff that I kind of wanted to talk about for a while. I am also going to be reworking how YouTube Shorts works as well, so, yeah, you know, I'll just explain it here. Um, if there's anything from Rush of You or anything from my long-form content, I will not push this out to the subfeed. If it's something original, then I will push it out to the subfeed. That's all I'm going to say. Anyway, yeah, that's it for me. Before we go, I do want to leave you with this teaser for one of the upcoming Rush of Yous that I have been thinking about for a little bit. I've already done, like, the intro and stuff like that because it was an idea that kind of just swam around my head for a little bit. I mean, I thought it'd be a cool idea, so I hope you guys think it's a good idea, too. Anyway, see you guys around, and I'll see you next year. Okay, so change of plans. I'm just gonna straight up say what it was. It's a video based off Michael Jackson games, and originally I was just gonna show you the intro that I'd made, but unfortunately, it contains copyrighted stuff, and it caused the video on YouTube specifically to get blocked worldwide when I tried to schedule it. Stupid antiquated copyright laws, you piece of shit! Kind of foreboding at the same time, too, because I also plan on looking at the Guitar Hero and Rock Band titles eventually, and I don't know if I'm going to get screwed over by copyright. If it gets too risky, I'll either have to take the L or just scrap both of them outright. So, uh, yeah, I'll see if there's demand for it. Anyway, enough dilly-dallying. I need a goddamn break. I'll see you guys next year. Good lord. I really need a rest at this point.